after the first 50 miler, I started running ultra after ultra after ultra in the mountains by myself. And I started skipping work to do it. And then I ultimately quit my job and just ran full time for a period. Now I think I've probably run 22 or 23 mountain ultras solo and unsupported. I chose the Patagonia Evermore because of its minimal drop and the fact that it's sensitive enough I can feel the ground through the shoes. Also, the tread design is really good for the Pacific Northwest mud, wet rocks, wet roots, uh, and the mesh on the side allows water to flow in and out freely. I also appreciate that I can recycle my shoes when I'm done. I go through about 12 pairs of shoes a year and it pains me to throw them in the trash when they're spent. The fit of this shoe is really optimal for me given that the heel cup is well molded and high, also narrow enough to pinch my heel down and not let it slide around. I like the forefoot because it's wide enough, my toes can spread out giving me a lot more power when I push off, as well as when I'm running longer distances my toes can expand and not get blistered or stacked.